It's high tech, images are sharp and clear, and it breaks the rules. It was a risky leap, was it worth it? Hi, I'm Brian Gill from Providian Medical, and this is the GE Vivid IQ Advanced Portable Cardiovascular Ultrasound Machine with shared service capabilities. This cool little machine is a highly advanced portable ultrasound in all aspects, including great imaging and a head-first leap into touchscreen technology. This leap took some guts, and the machine is definitely ahead of the market. But being innovative and taking risks does not always equal usefulness or efficiency. And that was exactly my first impression on using this machine. And this wasn't just my feeling. Four out of the first five users I spoke with had that same impression. For example, before I even turned this machine on, I was already frustrated. I opened the lid and I was like, ah, cool. And that quickly followed into, you have got to be kidding me. There's no physical keyboard. This is an advanced cardiovascular ultrasound machine and you're stuck with a touchscreen keyboard. Now maybe I'm not like most people, but I do not enjoy using a touchscreen keyboard. They're painstakingly slow as you have to sit and poke and stab at the glass, leaving behind gel and fingerprints all over the screen. And atop that, I also noticed there aren't any hard keys, just the easy twist knobs for gain or depth. You're stuck with the touchscreen again. Now luckily, GE did put a lot of hard keys on there for things like freeze and store and various imaging modes to help with efficiency, as well as a trackpad that works really well. But why is there no keyboard? Well, GE's main thought there was for easy cleaning and just swipe it with a disinfectant and everything is wonderful. Now that claim is true, but it's a bit strong. There still are gaps and crevices in there that can't be easily cleaned, but I do get it. It's still much easier to clean and much more sanitary than a standard keyboard where everything can fall in between those keys, but by no means is it a sealed user interface like the Sonosite Edge. But I digress. Now, in general, I really don't like to go negative in the first part of my review, but in this case, I'm addressing the same initial concern people tend to have with this machine. And you need to know that you should not dismiss this system because of the lack of keyboard and some basic controls. As it turns out, after a short learning curve, and once you figure out where everything is, you'll probably find that there are benefits to this touchscreen that outweigh the negatives. Even more than that, the image quality is unparalleled in the market. Now, those are my opinions, and so then I took this Vivid IQ on the road to find out if other people felt the same way. I took it to cardiologists and experienced technicians, and hands down, they felt the image quality was superior to any portable cardiovascular machine they'd seen or used. The words they described it to describe the image were crisp, clean, and superior. In side-by-side -side tests with other equipment, the Vivid IQ wins. It's smaller, has better resolution, has an overall better workflow, and works very well once you get used to the user interface. The penetration was good, frame rates were high, it's very fast, and overall, anyone using the system was totally impressed with its imaging and speed. Now, nearly everyone gets over the lack of keyboard because so many good features offset this little annoyance. Now, there was one person who didn't mind the keyboard. She was the lone millennial who approached this machine as though she'd been using it for years and we all just sat and were like, oh cool, I didn't know we could do that. Now imagine that. So another bonus on this machine as frankly, it just looks really cool. And to be honest, this cool factor really gives an added bonus because it gives constant confidence to patients. And when you look at it, it, it really just feels good when you use it. So overall, does the Vivid IQ beat its main competitors like the Mindray M9 and the CX50? For the most part, yes, and this is true for many reasons. First, the CX50 platform has been around since 2008. It's large, a bit clunky, heavy, and it's due for an upgrade. Yes, it has great image quality and is powerful, but it did just get beat by the Vivid IQ. Now the Mindray M9, it's more of a whole body system that does do a great job, but it's rare to find someone who finds the M9 over the Vivid IQ for cardiac imaging. Additionally, the Vivid IQ has the most advanced feature set and workflow of any portable cardiovascular machine out there. This truly mimics a high-end console cardiovascular machine. Its features include TBI, tissue tracking, strain, strain rate, stress echo, 40 and multi-plane TEE, ICE, AFI, 
HL7 compliance, tissue synchronization, Scan Assist Pro, Logic View panoramic imaging, blood flow imaging, contrast, and quantitative analysis package for tissue velocity and contrast imaging, plus pre-programmed diagnostic codes that can be added to your report. And plus, it weighs less than 10 pounds and it is fast. Saving clips doesn't slow down your workflow because it happens so quickly. And there are many tools to shorten your exam time and are designed to limit typing to as little as possible. So if you are lucky enough to get one of these in your office, I have some advice. First, it's really important to dig deep into the system and spend some time learning it. The Vivid IQ uses some new terminology for common functions where you find yourself searching and searching for a feature only to find it's been named something else or is hidden behind one of its many panels. Now to help you with this, I've created a free training series on the Vivid IQ here on the Providian Medical website. These videos cover many of the things that are not included in the 750 page user manual and you can basically forget about using the online help on the system. It's really not user friendly at all. Now my training videos are free and I hope they can get you started quickly on using this machine so you don't have to search too deep without, to find what you need. Now to sum up my review, this is the most advanced and powerful portable cardiovascular machine on the market. The image quality is fantastic and its price is very competitive for the portable cardiovascular machine. Its advanced functionality allows it to be versatile for very high-end environments that were previously reserved for big, expensive console units. Yes, you really do need to spend some time with this and learn how to change your workflow and become accustomed to how you do things on this machine. But for the most part, you'll find that this is a big improvement over anything that's out there. Because when it comes down to it, it is fairly easy to use and the machine is fantastic. This leap in technology, it's long overdue in our market and it was time for someone to jump in and put this something like this into the market. It was a bit risky for GE to do this, but they did a very nice job in creating the best portable cardiovascular ultrasound machine on the market. Kudos to you, GE. I'm Brian Gill from Providian Medical and that's what you need to know about the GE Vivid IQ portable cardiovascular ultrasound machine. Thanks for watching.